So this is this big hole in the ground is our quarter million gallon elephant pool uh, that we obviously just dug out. We'll be going in the summer and this will be one of the largest animal pools in the world actually. But Elephant Trek in general is actually a big part of our net zero water project. A dozen years ago we started this effort uh, which is capturing rainwater that hits our zoo and cleaning it up and reusing it for all of our facilities. Well for us almost 98 percent of our water usage is for for habitats for all these different pools from sea otters to elephants to fiona that's where all of our water goes so when we said net, net zero water what we're saying is none of our non-potable water usage will come from city water so in other words so it's pools hose down irrigation all of that will come from rainwater that we collect store and clean uh, here at the zoo it started about a dozen years ago in Africa. We have a 400,000 gallon tank in Africa under Fiona uh, that takes care of all the water for that part of the zoo. And then for Rue Valley, we put in a 100,000 gallon tank for that part of the zoo. And now Elephant Truck, um, we are going to be putting in over that big dirt pile, a million gallon essentially cistern. Now, <clears throat> half the zoo drains down into this exhibit and we collected there and obviously some of the water will be used for this elephant pool to make sure it's topped off. But actually we're gonna be piping this system all the way up into the heart of the zoo, into Manatee and the reptile house and the Velt, et cetera, et cetera, gorilla facility. Uh, that's the work that will be going on over the next couple winters to take that water back up into the zoo uh, to take care of those facilities. And that's how we're gonna to get to net zero water. It's gonna take us a couple more years, uh, but this pool, this exhibit, uh, is really the keystone of our net zero water project. It's best in class water for animals, keeping rainwater out of the combined sewer system, which is a huge issue in Hamilton County. Uh, and it saves us some money uh, so we don't have to buy that water. So it's win-win all the way around.